Hey guys, this is James and welcome to a new Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. Today we're going to see how we can adjust the B-rolls when you are editing shorts or any kind of video automatically in Adobe Premiere Pro. So most of the time when I record my video, I shoot the B-roll in horizontal format. So if I want to make a vertical video out of that topic, then how I can adjust those B-roll easily, right? So here you can see an example. Here is a video. This is a vertical video, right? But I want to use this horizontal video as a zero. So if I just make an in point and out point, and if I drag this video here on my timeline, then what will happen if I play it back, you can see the video is not filling the whole resolution. So normally what we do manually, if you want to adjust it, you can just scale it up and then you can adjust the position and if your video is moving then you have to keyframe the position and whatnot right and of course using the properties panel in adobe premiere pro you can just click on fill to fill it but if your subject is moving or the b-roll is moving then how you can adjust that property you need to keyframe the each individual position right but if you use an effect called auto frame you can do it automatically let me show you how so here is my video if i go to my effects panel i can search for auto reframe and then if i just click and drag this auto reframe here it will automatically fill up the entire resolution and it will track the subject in the middle of my video if i play it back with this case should i keep the case you can see the, the subject is so in the I middle of do, my I... video frame and if you want to position the subject creatively like if you want to follow the rule of third what you can do you can select that b-roll and if you go to effects control panel you can offset the tracking so here if i adjust the reframe offset value i can position the subject here in this side right now if i play it back you'll see that subject is staying on that position oh, what can i do with this case should i keep the case in my pocket so, so that is the easiest way to use your horizontal b-roll on top of any vertical videos now you know that so that is all for today i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you need this channel want to learn adobe Premiere pro or video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more awesome video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye